To measure distance, you can easily use a tape measurement, but the tape has a length limitation, so it is hard to measure a long distance. I'm going to show you my new project that uses a rolling method so that it has no limit by the length like using the tape. First, I designed a 16 inch circumference disc and is divided into 16 sectors so that each sector curve length is 1 inch, which is right there. So it is colored black and white alternatively. I put an IR track sensor that can detect a difference between black and white, which is right there. So when the disc has rolled against an object, the sensor can send a signal to a microbit every time the color changes, and it means one inch of length has passed. Thus, I keep counting how much time from the starting point to the end point to measure the distance. Coding is very simple on this project. The A button is to reset the distance value to zero. When pin zero is connected and when pin one is connected are alternatively active from the sensor when the disc is moving. When either one is connected, change the value of the distance variable by one and then change the value of feet by one every 12 inches. It's time to test it out. So plug in your micro bit. Okay, smiley face, that's a good thing. So first I'm going to measure with my machine, then I'm going to measure with my tape measure. So I'm going to start right here. Okay, we're halfway there. And there. Let's see it. Button B, 49. And we're going to be measuring this with my tape measure. All right, so I'm going to use some help. It is about 48, which is four feet. It said 49. A bit off, but okay. So the next thing we're going to be measuring is this chair here. Sorry, I'm going to be first doing the tape measure this time. Right. Ah. It's about 28. Grab it. All right. Three. Don't forget to hit A. Two. One. Go. Okay. And it says 29. Again, close. It was one inch off, but at least it's, again, still accurate. So that is how our machine test was. On with the code. The code part is simple. So we're going to start off with the on start. We don't need the forever. So the on start, all it does is just going to tell us that it's logged in by doing this. It's just going to set distance to zero. And it's just going to show icon, smiley face, like this. You can choose any. I prefer the smiley face. Then we're going to have it show LEDs blank. So it's just nothing. So on button A, it's going to be a resetter by setting distance to zero and it's going to show string distance. We need to go to variables and make a variable to make distance and then drag the distance block into here and show string distance, which would be zero. On button B, it's going to show the final results or whatever it's currently on. On button A, B, it's going to show what what the distance is, but in feet and inches. They're all, that's all there is for the buttons. Then for the pins, we're just going to be changing distance by one. Very simple. So that's how you do the code.